John Wayne returns tomorrow morning behind and in front of the camera. He's Davy Crockett in the spectacular epic story of the Battle of the Alamo. That's at nine o'clock on BBC Two. Enjoy the magic of Boxing Day on BBC One. At 6.15, the Antiques Roadshow goes live in a special edition for young people. What's this frock worth now? That would make about 100 to 150 now. And it's really, I mean, it costs a few shillings at the time. At 7, Grant has a surprise. Sharon, don't. Come on. Don't touch me. I thought you'd like it. I thought you'd like well, it. Well, I don't, do I? And there's trouble for Bergerac at 7.30. You haven't got a cat in hell's chance of copying anyone without a confessional. I'm gathering the evidence. And a lot of it is pointing at you. At 9.35, A Fish Called Wonder. Award-winning comedy with Kevin Klein, the long-suffering Michael Palin, Jamie Lee Curtis and John Cleese. <laughs> A Boxing Day of Delights, this Christmas on BBC One. And this is how the eve of Christmas plans to get you in the mood for the big day with thigh-slapping panto beginnings at 6.30 as Jim Davidson hosts a very special big break. Albert Square adds the final touches to its festive preparations at 7 and that's followed at 7.30 by the first of a special two-part Christmas Only Fools and Horses with the brothers Trotter partaking of the holiday spirit. Renee's spirits take a battering at 8.20 when Yvette reveals that she has a croissant in the oven. The news is at five past nine, and then at 9.30, Kevin Costner, Gene Hackman and Sean Young are caught up in a murky political conspiracy. A stylish murder mystery which twists and turns its way to a frightening conclusion. There's no way out. At 11.20, we prepare to herald Christmas morning at London's Southwark Cathedral, with a candlelit service of carols and readings led by the very Reverend David Edwards. 12.30 and Michael Caine musters a motley crew of criminals for a multi-million dollar gold heist in the classic comedy caper, The Italian Job. Christmas Eve on BBC One. And now look at the weather. Wintry showers will continue in the north and west of Britain throughout the night with slight falls of snow in the highlands and northern Pennines. The gales will continue to die down but sheltered areas will have a slight frost. Christmas Eve will be bright and breezy with a fair amount of sunshine. Further showers are likely, especially over Scotland, where hail and thunder are possible. Cloud will increase in the far west during the afternoon. It'll feel cold in the northwest wind, with temperatures mainly between 6 to 8 degrees Celsius, that's 43 to 46 Fahrenheit, and falling sharply as heavier showers come along. Well, now there's the clock heralding BBC One's imminent departure. It's 28 minutes before two, just time for me to point you in the direction of BBC Radio. Bob Harris is on one and Bill Reynolds is on two. We on BBC One would like to thank you for your company this evening. I, Jane Constantinis, would like to wish you, on behalf of everyone here at Television Centre, a very good night. <laughs>